What is going on guys? It is your boy Jay, you already know. Welcome back to the Treehouse. I appreciate you guys all for checking on this video. So, today I'm gonna go to the gym, and then afterwards I got a story for you guys, and I hope you guys enjoy it. So, if you guys are ready for the ride, let's let's get on out of here. Oh, jeez. All right guys, I'm actually gonna hit a uh, leg and a little bit of back workout. I'm not gonna show too much of it, um, cause I just wanna kinda get in and out. So, hope you guys enjoy. Finishing up my walk on the treadmill. I am sweaty, I have no get on. Check this out. It's nuts. <laughs> but hold on one second, let me clean this off. Guys, it's time to head back to the house. Quick, Remington and Grant, say hi to my people. <laughs> you heard him say it, you gotta do it now. But I will see you guys when I am back at my house. All right guys, just got back from the gym, all showered up, looking, looking fresh as always. But, so the story I wanted to tell you guys today um, was like the first time that I lost a lot of weight. <clears throat> so, as all stories, as all stories um, go, <laughs> starts out with somebody of the opposite sex, or I mean, somebody who you were in a relationship with. So my girlfriend at the time, she had ended up uh, uh, cheating on me, and my first thought was because I was fat, because at that time I was like 400 pounds, right, and she was like a smaller, <laughs> and so um, I ended up purchasing the P90X program, and. With the first week that I did it, I actually rolled my ankle and like was like, oh, I don't know, this is how this is gonna happen, right? As all things happen. But I ended up sticking to it and the first month I didn't lose that much weight, which was really confusing to me because everybody tells you like, oh yeah, you're, you'll lose weight really fast, but I didn't change my eating. And that was probably the biggest key for the like starting something out, right? You have to change how you're eating and that's one of the big, big, big issues. So I talked to one of my really good friends, Shane Bigham, at the time, and uh, he had lost a lot of weight. He lost like 60, or no, he had lost like 80 pounds. And I was like, dude, how did you do this? Cause I'm working my ass off and not losing anything. He's like, man, you gotta change the way you're eating. So he, we talked for like six hours one night and uh, he just taught me like, what to eat, what not to eat, X, Y, and Z, right? But I still didn't understand a lot of the stuff, but I just kind of went off of what he said and I ate consistently almost the exact same thing every single day for like months and months and months. <laughs> it felt like forever. Uh, it was probably like nine months, ate like the same exact thing almost every single day, day in, day out. And then I ended up losing about over, the whole time that I lost weight was like 18 months. I ended up losing 200 pounds, but in the, the majority of the weight that I lost was in the last eight to nine months. And I lost over 140 pounds in the last eight to nine months, which is insane. Um, but I had been, I was in a, ca a caloric deficit and I was working out a ton. I ended up going from 400 pounds from 400 pounds to 200 pounds in 18 months 
basically, but the majority of it was in the last, the last eight months. So I actually ended up being on TV. One of my friends wrote into the newspaper, newspaper ran a story and then the TV caught on and I was actually supposed to go on the doctor's TV show, but that didn't happen because X, Y, Z, whatever. But so I ended up going to basic training. I joined the army, went to basic training, I ended up gaining like 10, 10 to 15 pounds while I was there um, because I actually had worked out more on my own than I did at basic training, which is nuts to say, but I worked out for like six hours a day almost. And then when I was in basic training, like it wasn't that much, probably like through two to three hours is when of actual workout time, right? And then I went to, then I got stationed in Italy. My first couple months in Italy, I actually gained a ton of weight. I gained like 45 pounds, 45, 50 pounds, just because me and my ex-wife had, uh, we were living in the hotel and we didn't have like an oven, we didn't have a stove. We literally just ate out every single day and I gained a ton of weight. And um, I actually talked to my first sergeant about getting the weight loss surge or the, uh, the skin removal surgery because I had a lot of excess skin. I wanted to get rid of it. And he said, they told me that I had to lose weight. So I ended up losing like 30 pounds and getting in probably the best shape of my life while I was over there. And uh, long story short, I didn't get the surgery. So fast forward, um, right before I got out of the army, I had got to play in some basketball games. I got to play against Michigan, Notre Dame, um, Kennesaw State, we ended up getting to play against American teams that came over for the NCAA tour that they had um, back then. And I had my, I was trying to get my game footage sent to Ohio State so I could see if I could try to play there when I got out of the Army. Um, and a month before I got out of the Army, I ended up fracturing my ankle. <laughs> Lucky me, right? <laughs> so I ended up fracturing my ankle and uh, got out of the Army. And I like to run, that was like my thing. Um, the first time I lost weight, I ended up enjoying running so much, I liked to run. So I ended up not being able to for a little bit. <clears throat> Started playing flag football once my ankle healed. And uh, it was really good, playing awesome, having a good time. Then I ended up tearing my ACL, playing flag football of all things. Had to wait eight months to, eight months to get the surgery for it because the VA was taking so long and X, Y, and Z, you know how that goes. Um, ended up gaining over 100 pounds in that eight months because eating like crap and not being able to, to work out the way I like to work out. It's excuses, I get it. <laughs> so I ended up getting up to about 370 pounds um, before I had the surgery again. And <laughs> my goal was to just lose weight again, whatever, it's not gonna be that hard. I did it once before, I did it, I'm gonna do it again, X, Y, and Z, you know how it is. Um, didn't work out that way, but I ended up starting to play um, basketball and stuff again. And as you guys, who, if, if you've been following me since I started this channel, I ended up losing about 60 to 75 pounds, be, or 60 to 70 pounds before I tore my ACL again <laughs> earlier in March or in February. I'll put the video up here because I was recording because I was doing my YouTube videos then. So this ends up bringing us to almost where we're at right now. Um, I ended up tearing my ACL in, in February, got the surgery in March, and I've been <laughs> trying again to lose weight. Um, so that's how I went from fat to fit to fat. <laughs> And hopefully on the other side of this, we can get, we can get fit again. Cause I will show you, I'm sure you guys have already seen the pictures right now. I, I might've already put them up on there, but I was, I was real cut up at one point and that's what we're going for again. So I know this was a kind of long story and uh, I, I appreciate you guys all if you've been staying with it till this point. Um, that's really all I had. I kind of just wanted to tell that story to you guys. So if you guys like this video, hit that thumbs up button. I really appreciate it. it helps me out more than you know. Um, if you're not subscribed to my channel, hit the subscribe button and hit the little bell button right beside it. My dog is chewing on a bone right now. Jess, is that bone good? But like I said, I appreciate you guys all for watching this video. Um, we're gonna be, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna lose the weight. I'm gonna lose the weight. Don't you, don't you, don't you guys, uh, 
Don't you guys lose faith in me. I promise you. <laughs> hey, have a good rest of the day, guys. And peace. Windowception. Windowception. <laughs>